Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So, today we're going back to the bins. I know I was just there, but we're going back. I didn't go thrifting all week long, so I really need to get some new stuff because I ran out of stuff to post, basically. I've been posting some things here and there that I've been finding around the house, but I really need to get on it. So, today I'm going to take you guys to the bins with me. Hopefully I can get right in. It's Father's Day. Um, it's Sunday, people are at church, blah, blah, blah. I found that Sundays it's easier to get in. If you guys are new to my channel, hello, welcome. If you are returning, hello, welcome. Um, I am a reseller on Poshmark and Mercari. I don't do eBay. I post on eBay and literally nobody buys anything, so I've kind of given up on that. Sometimes I cross post. But basically, yeah, today I am looking for clothes. It's gonna be really hard to beat Wednesday's video because I found some really good stuff. I'll link it down below if you haven't watched it, but basically I found real Louis Vuitton, I found Everlane, like real good stuff. Oh, so I have low hopes for today. Gosh, there it is like nobody here. This is awesome. I found these Seychelles and as I was putting them back in my car I found this huge stain on them so I'm putting them back. brand that I'm gonna pass on because of wear. It's Wilfred, but it's all stained, so. <sighs> I'm getting really bored because there's nothing good. I've only found three things so far, and everything else, it's like a good brand, but it's really worn out. Like, I found stuff from Maurizio, Victoria's Secret, Maybe I'm just not really feeling like digging today either. But sometimes all it takes is one good find and then you're like re-energized and good to go. I just haven't really had that yet. There's a lot of hard goods and baby clothes. Ugh. failing right now. I found these leggings from Athleta. Take those. I found a Burberry sweater. A lemon bra. I'm gonna wash it and see how it goes. Oh, we need the poo tie. I need to look at comps for. A BB Dakota like romper and then a skirt. So not not great because I mean this is stained and I need to look up comps for everything else. So it's not going well. That was quite the underwhelming trip. Some people might think that I found good stuff. Personally, I'm not I'm not really excited by it. But then again, I had a really good trip last time, so. 
So I'm gonna just jump right into it and show you guys what I got. I was so uninspired that I barely even filmed in there, but yeah. Okay, so I got this, what is it called? Longchamp Tote. It's the, let's see, it's the Le Pliage Extendable model. So if this doesn't sell, I could keep it for myself. I actually need a new like weekender type bag. The only thing about this, which I think is maybe why people didn't pick it up, is because, oh, this is really weird, but on the inside it says NBC Universal. I don't know why it says that, but hopefully nobody cares because it's on the inside. The comps for that are all over the place, so I'm going to have to do a little bit more research. I got these boots. They're Steve Madden booties. They have like the cutout, and honestly, they look like they've been worn maybe just like two times. And they're my size, and they're really cute, but I'm going to sell them. I got a pair of Athleta leggings. They're an extra small, but um, they look like they could fit a small too. And they're ombre, and they're in a really good condition. I thought these were kind of cute. Usually I don't pick up Athleta or try not to, but I like these a lot and the logo is not cracked or anything. So I got that. I got a Winnie the Pooh tie, which normally I don't pick ties up, but it was Disney brand and it was in really good shape. So I figured I, I might as well. It's probably like, it probably cost me next to nothing. This was a new to me brand that was kind of exciting. So this is a Burberry sweater it's 100 percent fine merino wool it looks like it definitely shrunk so i have to post measurements but it has the little doogad thing on it couple is full on making out behind me it looked like someone was selling this for 70 dollars. doesn't mean it'll sell for 70 dollars, but even if it's sold for like 20 or 30 for a bins fine it's not bad i got this society amuse skirt which is a new to me brand but i'm pretty sure i've seen this at nordstrom but it's just a maxi skirt and i thought it was so so cute i think this would look actually really cute with those booties comps for that were like 20 to 25. this i thought was really cute and it was actually just dry cleaned um you could tell because it has like this little tag on it the little orange tag but it's a bb dakota um wrap type dress the wrap actually snaps in the front and i thought this was so cute and i believe they sell this at revolve and a bunch of other stores but i like that it was just dry cleaned because then i don't have to wash it this might have been a total miss but i'm gonna wash it and see um it's a lululemon bra and this is only my second time finding lululemon there it has like an onion stuck to it okay but it just looks like that and it has a strappy back and yeah it's not in the best condition but i can hopefully get the stains out a lot of things were really badly stained like beyond repair and i found some really good brands it's just it was just kind of a crappy day i was not into it whatever and then i bought tissue paper because i hate buying tissue paper around christmas time it's so overpriced so i figured this would probably be like 50 cents yeah that's all i got i know i seem uh disappointed it's because i kind of am everything was really gross and picked over and dirty so which that's the bins for you you know sometimes you win sometimes you lose it's going to be hard to top the louis vuitton strap but what can you do so anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys next time bye mm -hmm.